guess that's all that we can do here. Uh, so let's head up. Like I said, I didn't get those done last time, so I didn't really, I didn't know if there were going to be more that I could do here, but apparently there isn't. I like how they like haven't had anybody fill up the cage yet. You know, just just can I, can I close it? Okay, that was that was glitchy, but I closed it. You're welcome, Sten. Now you won't have that memory to haunt you. So I guess we are done here. So let's just uh, head up the bridge and we can make our escape because I'm not going to the freaking spiders because spiders, they might be over leveled. I know I took on bears, but those are spiders. It's different. Oh crap. Those, those would be dark spawn, wouldn't they? What? Someone help us! Crap. That's the leader, isn't it? He looks like a leader. Yeah, Alpha. There he is. Alright, let's see if I can get like a crippling shot off. And then pinning shot. I forgot which one that was. But I want to get the Alpha first. Now I can head up here and I can start doing damage to somebody else that's, that's getting hurt pretty bad. And I can... Damn, we're kicking ass now. Apparently, what little I did for the tactics is really making a difference here. Kill him. Then kill kill the jump. Alright, let's switch. Let's switch. St hit him. Stunned. Alright, now kill the Herlock. Wow, we are we are doing very good here. Apparently small increments is good. What what are you doing? S Sandal? Your name is Sandal. Why is your name Sandal? I'm gonna call you Flip Flop. Flip Flop, what are you doing? And Maleficarum regrets. Okay. Damn it! Timely arrival there, my friend. I'm much obliged. Hey, you guys are dwarves. Well, you're a dwarf. You're a shaved dwarf, so you're a gnome. That's what I'm calling you. I wasn't trying to. S yeah. Just how obliged I exactly? You gonna give me money? You want a reward, eh? I suppose that's. An entirely reasonable request? Of course it is. I made a hundred silver, Sam. I was going to use that to fix up the cart, but uh, quite frankly, I'll be grateful enough that my son and I come out of this with our heads. That's your son? It doesn't really look like you, other than he's a dwarf. Well, no. <laughs> Yet you have a whole cart full of goods. <laughs> Which are unsold, I'm afraid. A hundred silver, and my thanks, is all I have to offer. The name's Rodon Fedek, merchant and entrepreneur. This here is my son, Flip Sam. Flop. Say hello, my boy. Hello. Road's been mighty dangerous these days. Mind if I ask what brings you out here? Perhaps we're going the same way. Uh, I doubt you want to travel with a Grey Ward. Not better than you! Grey Wards? Hmm. My, that does rather explain a lot. Just two of us. No offense, but I suspect there's more excitement on your path than my boy and I can have. Allow me to bid you farewell and good fortune. Goodbye. Now then, let's get this mess cleaned up, shall we? Uh, okay. Bye, flip flop. Huh. Still says I can like talk to him or whatever. Topaz. That's all he's got. I'm sure the gems are worth something. I don't know what, but I haven't sold them. I haven't sold them. Don't worry about that. Stud leather boots. Those could be good for somebody. And another gift that I can sell. Very nice. Uh, can I still talk to you? We'll be off as soon as this mess is cleaned up. Thank you kindly for all your assistance. You're, you're welcome. Uh, wow, I, uh, he actually gave me the money. That's new. I don't usually get the money when they say it. At least the, the other bandits when I got into town didn't. Uh, looks like we are done here, though. Let's just get on out. Saving the game. Quest completed. You have trouble passing right now on the Imperial Highway, which... Oh, okay, apparently I did one of the quests for the Blight. Uh, the highway will take you to various places you will need to go. Redcliffe, the Bras Brazilian Forest, the Circle of Magi's Tower, and the Dwarven City of Orzammar. They told me I needed to go, like, Redcliffe first, though, didn't they? Does that really matter? Current quests. Completed. Codex. Conversation history. Uh, really? Conversation history? Yeah, look at that. That is... Ugh, and that's not even, like, all the way back. That's ridiculous that they would keep track of that. Alright, so Redcliffe, 
uh, is is probably the next place that I need to go. So let's head, yes, let's head that way, I guess. If you play while logged in, your online profile is automatically updated. I understand how online mode works, game. Uh, who's starting, like, gaming with Dragon Age Origins? I mean, this is this is not the game to do it. Oh, cutscene. That would be a dragon, I assume. Spoiler alert, there's probably going to be dragons in Dragon Age Origins. That's, that, I don't know how big of a, a spoiler that bad is for dreams. anybody. I, I did have a bad dream. Why are you bothering me? I'm fine. It's just that you were shouting in your sleep, loud, and not in a good, this is private way either. What? You see, part of being a Grey Warden is being able to hear the dark spawn. That's what your dream was, hearing them. The Archdemon, it talks to the Horde, and we feel it just as they do. That's why we know this is really a blight. Interesting. Yeah, the dragon? Is that the Archdemon? I don't know if it's really a dragon, but it sure looks like one. But yes, that's the Archdemon. It Fair takes enough. a bit, but eventually you can block the dreams out. Some of the older Grey Wardens say they can understand the Archdemon a bit, but I sure can't. Anyhow, when I heard you thrashing around, I thought I should tell you. It was scary at first for me, too. Okay, so I just want to stop you for a second here. He kind of implied that if I was having, like, a wet dream, that he would have just let me go, and he wouldn't have said anything. That... that's kind of creepy, Alistair. I... I... what... I don't know what's creepier though. Do you wake the guy up if you if, like sleep over and he's having a wet dream? What the hell do you do? I, I, I would just probably walk away. I wouldn't stand there and stare at him, freaking Alistair. Any other surprises I should know about? Other than dying young and the whole defeat the blight alone thing? No. I'm all tapped out for surprises. Anyhow, you're up now, right? Let's pull up camp and get a move on. What? We're done? In camp? I just got here. New quest. Enchantment. Soldiers be... Holy crap. Alyssa disapproves. I, I, I don't blame him. I made fun of him. Uh, premium content. I, I got premium, premium content, apparently. Uh, I don't think I want to do the premium content just yet. I pretty much just started the game. I don't know if, like, enemies level with me or whatever. Uh, what's up, Liliana? How you doing? Are, are you happy now that you're clothed? She was, uh, she was like in a, I don't even know, cloth bikini for a while when, when I, I didn't have enough equipment to give her anything and I gave it all to Stan. Yes? Hi. I'd like to talk. Well, here I am. Fair enough. What was life like in the Chantry Cloister? Quiet. It was a life suited for contemplation. In the cloister, away from the fuss and the flurry of the cities, I found peace. And in that stillness, I could hear the Maker. But it was not perfect. Some of my Chantry fellows were condescending. That is the nature of religious folk, I suppose. I probably shouldn't be talking to religious people in case I make fun of them. Uh, you are definitely religious. I'm trying to pinpoint her accent, though, to be honest with you. It's not quite British. It's like British-French, British... French, British British something. It's 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 not all there. British German? I I can't I cannot place it to save my life. Condescending? How so? No, wait. I'm supposed to be evil. They tend to be self-righteous. Yes, of course when they I do. When I talked about my beliefs, that the Maker reveals himself in the beauty of his world, they treated me with disdain. They want to believe that he's gone, so that when he turns his gaze on them, it means they are special, chosen. He cannot possibly have love for all. The sick and the weary, the beggars and the fools. This is very narrow of a religion that you have. Interesting. I don't really want the maker looking in on me anyway. You should see the stuff I do when his back is turned. Maybe I am wrong. But it is the maker's place to decide if I am worthy. Not men. Not the chantry. But there is work to be done. And I have talked enough for now. 
and she kicked us out, and she neither approved nor disapproved of what we had to say there. Damn, that is a lot of arrows. Wait, are those the dwarves? It is the dwarves! Flip-flop, how you doing? And Sten, we're talking to you first. What's up, Sten? Are you going to take off your, your mask for the cutscene? You are! I'm stopping. Be because I had to sleep and th think about the archdemon. We're... we're we're working together. I think I should get to know you. That's that's too nice. I think we should talk for a moment. Let, let's just get a few things straight. There are dark spawn to be fought. Is this delay needful? Probably not. You are going to be my tank. I hope. Eventually, eventually. He's not right now, but he, he he will eventually. I need to know if I can trust you at my back. I am Kunari. I have given my word to aid you. We are not people of idle promises. F fair enough. He's freaking. Kamari? He's Kamari. You can say Kunari all you want. You're freaking Kamari. Tell me about your old people. Wait, you said you were in the army? No, no tell me about your old people. No. <laughs> Short and sweet. Why not? People are not simple. They cannot be summarized for easy reference in the manner of the elves are a lithe, pointy eared people who excel at poverty. What the hell? You calling me poor? You bastard, I will steal everything you got. Not because I'm poor, but because I want more money. You said you were in the army? I am. You're still in the army. Have you ever fought in a war? I have always fought in war, Elf. What do you mean by that? My people have been at war since the moment we set foot in the Northern Islands. We're in islands up here. Fair enough. They don't come from the islands. We do now. <laughs> Short and sweet. I kind of like this. I, I kind of go through it very quickly. Who are you fighting? The enemy is everywhere. The jungle itself. Vipers, hunting cats. Even some of the flowers can kill the unwary. And always there is the Imperium. And the Tal Vashoth. I don't like the sound of Tal anything anymore, to be honest with you. Well, well, Tal, I guess, is okay. It's Tal that I'm thinking of. Uh, why are you fighting the Imperium? Because they fight us, of course. The Tevinter want nothing more than our absence. They tell us this with magic and steel and death. That sends a strong I do message. Not see how this matters. Seheron and Parvolan are distant. Ferelden and the Darkspawn are immediate. Uh, are you alright? You were in that cage for weeks. You are concerned. Damn it. No need. I am fit enough to fight. No, I, I'm not concerned for your, your sake. I'm too evil for that. Yeah, I guess we should get moving. Does he approve of what I've done here, or does he hate me? He approves a little bit. I'm not sure if that means I'm still evil or not. Hey! There she is. Now, I am going to try to get... Yeah, what, what are you still doing here? You get out of here. I'm going to try to get her to take that half inch of, of clothing between... Jeez, She's got, like, nothing on. I'm going to try to get her to take that off, and I'm going to be unsuccessful at it. What is with your freaking staff? It's not attached to you in the slightest. You have freaking levitation magic with your st whatever. What do you wish of me? I'd like to ask you something. If you must. Uh, none of these are, like, things I can say sexily. <laughs> How did you become a shape changer? I was not born such. Tis a skill of Flemeth's, taught over many years in the wild. Don't bring up your mom. The chastened have tales of we witches, saying that we assume the forms of creatures to watch them from hiding. When a child okay. is alone and separate from his tribe, that is when we strike, dragging the young boy kicking and screaming to our lair to be devoured. A most amusing legend. What do you mean by devoured? Is this a good thing or a bad thing? That does sound so like something you'd do. Oh? I truly doubt that children would be worth the effort. They are filthy, smelly things full of tears and snot and trouble. That said, I cannot speak for the tastes of my mother. She has, after all, lived a very lengthy time in the wilds and done many things I know nothing of. Why do you ask? Is there something specific you wish to know? Damn it, she can see right through my sarcasm. My greatest weapon is gone. Um, can anyone? No. 
Yeah, do you, do you spend a lot of time as an animal? There were nights when the wilds called to me, tis true. You look upon the world around you and you think you know it well. I have smelled it as a wolf, listened as a cat. Proud shadows that you never dreamed existed. Are you coming on but to my me? My life is as a human. I am under no illusions to the contrary. Fair enough. Um, can you change into other human forms? The form of an animal is different from my own. One may study the creature, learn to move as it does, think as it does. Okay. In time, this allows one to become as it is. Weird. I gain nothing by studying another human. I already am the same as they are. I learn nothing. So the answer is no. My human form is the only one I possess. So... Are these real? Is that a question I can ask? That makes that makes those real then, doesn't it? I'm pretty sure they don't have saline back in this day. Can anyone become a changer? Anyone with sufficient will. But the act of transformation is a magical one. Tis a spell and thus requires a mage's talent. Which I don't have. If you had a notion to learn such a skill for yourself, sadly, you must remain disappointed. Fair enough. I will remain human. <laughs> Talk about my personal life? No. No, that's not happening. Indeed. Have you an opinion on my abilities, then? Am I an unnatural abomination to be put to the torch? Uh, useful. Does seem a little revolting. Maybe tied to a flagpole and tickled. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's coy or or what. Uh, that would just make you angry, I think. No doubt it would. But enough of such talk. Let us proceed, lest the dust gather on us. And she approves. I got a plus one for that. Are you kidding me? Where do I have like a likability meter somewhere around here? I don't. I don't see anything here. That would. You know, she's a shapeshifter. I haven't seen her shapeshift, but uh, considering that we saw her mom do it, I guess that's. It's not a bad thing. Approval point plus nine. Okay, so oh. Here it is. This is what she wants. Okay, so... I, how do I give her something? Like, here you can have it. Gift. Gift. Inspect. Destroy. I can't, I can't gift it. They're not like, giving me the opportunity to do that. So let's talk to her a little bit more. What do you wish of me? Uh, I can tell you, but they won't give me the option. Uh, I'd like to ask you something. If you must. Have you ever been hunted by the Chantry? <laughs> you are very cute to ask so many questions. Are we getting somewhere here? Uh, and you are cute when you're evasive? Is this the time when I'm supposed to be flirty? Let's, let's go with that. Really? Perhaps we should be wrapped in ribbons and adorned with flowers. So cute are we, too. <laughs> My not, mother has been hunted sure from time to time, yes. By Templar fools like Alistair, which should tell you how successful they generally were. Flemeth made a bit of a game of it, in fact. The Templars would come again, and she would look at me and smile and say that the fun was to begin once more. That does not sound good. Dead. You really had no trouble with them? I am unsure. I was too young to understand, and perhaps it was bravado on Flemeth's part, or perhaps she was merely amused. I will never know. Interesting. Flemeth would warn them once. It was a warning they inevitably failed to heed. And then the true game began. Often Flemeth would use me as bait, <laughs> a little girl to scream and run and lure the Templars deeper into the wilds and to their doom. Uh, how little of a girl were you, and how, how were, what was the look on their face when they were chasing you? Uh, did you actually kill them all? Me? No. I never did any of the killing, until later. And even then, Flemeth was a glutton for that sort of thing. Interesting. Thankfully, the wilds is a vast place. Once they found us, Flemeth would simply move us elsewhere, and we would be lost within the forest once again. I did not understand the danger we faced until I was much older. I had never heard of apostates or maleficarum. 
You had a very interesting childhood. They got what they deserved. Perhaps they did. Still, I do not begrudge them doing what they believe is necessary. The Chantry sees any mages not leashed to the Circle of Magi as apostates. And apostates could become Maleficarum, evil mages that resort to blood magic and become demon-enslaved abominations. It may even be true. Still, those of us who prefer freedom see no reason to submit. I don't know how to read you. Am I, am I doing well here? Damn it. If I were a mage, I might think the same. Thank you for small favors, then, at the very least. Enough of this talk. Let us return to the task at hand. I can't tell. Is that good? Yes, a plus five. Very, very nice. Uh, I will continue trying to, to work on her uh, off screen because, well, uh, this this is taking longer than I thought. Jeez. How am I doing? Yeah, Alistair is not so, so hot on me. Morgan likes me. Stan is neutral, as you might expect. But she's only at plus 14, which is still neutral. Damn it. I'm going to need to gift her so many things. So many things. Let's talk to the people with shiny ah, things. What the hell? see you, my timely rescuer. Bodon Fedden, at your service. Once again, I saw your camp and thought to myself, what safer place to rest for the evening than in the camp of a grey wolf? Leave me alone. I'm perfectly willing to offer you a fine discount for the inconvenience of our presence. How does that sound? Good? Yes? S sure. W whatever you say. I was going to say, let's talk to the people with shiny things above their head, but they interrupted me to talk to me. Uh... Have you been following us? I can see why you might be suspicious, being a Grey Warden and all. Were I in your shoes, I would feel the same way. Trust me when I say that my encountering you here was serendipity and nothing more. I travel a lot, so I'm bound to meet everyone on the road eventually. Uh, if you right. prefer, I'll take my boy and be on my way. But regret, you're the safest spot on this road, without a doubt. Obviously, nobody would dare fight Charles Mahario. Just, just mind yourselves. Wonderful. Thank the gentleman, won't you, boy? Thank you, sir. We won't be a bother to you and your companions, I assure you. If you should need enchantments, simply talk to my boy. Otherwise, come speak with me. Um, enchantments? What? What do you mean, what do you mean enchantments? I can talk to you? S flip flop! Hello. Hi. The boy's a bit simple, but he's rather good with enchantments. One of those tranquil fellas actually called him a, what was he now? A savant. Seriously? I had no idea such a thing existed. Seriously? They put an idiot savant in the... Sure, why not? Let's, let's just use that as a, as a means to say that this guy is really good at this thing. He's probably the best guy in the world at, at enchantment. Uh, I want some enchanting done. Can I... Enchantment! Enchantment! Uh, I can... Holy crap, I can do something? Yeah! Uh, okay. Plus two electricity damage on the Oath Keeper. Uh, jeez, that's a main hand weapon. I'm, I'm, I want to. I want to. Let, okay, we put that there. And, and then we accept. And I did it! Hooray! Enchantment, I completed it. Uh, let's talk to, to, to you. If there's anything I can do for you, please, please tell me. What do you have? Let me see what you have. I'm sure you'll be pleased with the goods my boy and I have collected, and with your discount. Is it is it 100% off? Because that's what I'm really looking for. It's not. Uh, let's buy a few of these, because I'll probably be using them all the damn time. Lesser injury kits... Yeah, they're so expensive. They're as much as a health poultice. Uh, so I don't know if I'll be using those. I'm, I'll, I'll try to use them more often, but they're so damn expensive. So expensive. All right, uh, let's get a few flasks because I, I'm short on flasks at the moment. So I might as well. What the hell is this? Gives one point to spend on a talent or spell. Oh, it's like a skill book. Very nice. I can't afford it. Not even close, though. Do you have anything that I do want that is, like, good? Or is everything you have 
plus 5% critical backstab damage or a dexterity. I think the dexterity is better, to be honest with you. And then blood, dra blood dragon plates. Uh, Sten, if he sticks with me, will be the one that I give those to probably, but uh, he's not, he's not uh, close to strength yet. I think he's at 28 strength, so I can't give him any of the blood dragon stuff. Uh, I don't want to really spend anything over a gold just yet. I think it's too early for that. We can get more money. Interesting. Um, I, I probably I, I'm short on belt, so I might as well. Range critical chance. Yeah, we'll we'll go with that. Um, plus five percent fire damage, five percent cold damage. Once again, nothing over over uh, a cold here. Spell resistance. Yeah, the runes I'm sure are going to be ridiculously expensive. The hell a. I can give somebody a stick. Very nice. I'm not sure if they're going to like it. An Alistair doll. A pet rock. A yeah, fat loot. <laughs> you get it? Grey Warden hand puppet. I'm not going to get any of these gifts, but it looks like they're free. Ugly boot. I, I assume that like if I give this to somebody, they'll be mad at me because it's free, so I'm not going to. Uncrushable pigeon. This pigeon coos happily, apparently comfortable in the knowledge that no force could ever crush it. What the hell? Uh, 